so it is about 7 49 a.m in the morning unlike your favorite productivity <laughs> uh, channels i did not wake up at 5 a.m i did wake up around 7 um and i already um did my morning devotion i washed my face brushed my teeth put on my workout clothes and i'm gonna go out and walk a little bit one of the things that has really been lagging for me recently has been my exercises really really good with it in 2020 where i was walking two to three miles about five to six times a week but it has been super tough to do that especially in this season of life because i'm working two jobs as a science one as a full-time science writer and then i have a part-time job as a college instructor so it's been challenging so my goal is to be in my home office area which is this area by 8 30 between 8 30 and 8 45 i'm like sitting down and working so since this is what 7 50 a.m i can go out there walk get some exercise in even if all it is is for 20 minutes i got some exercise in and that's worth it so i'm gonna go do that and make sure that my butt is in my seat <laughs> by 8 30 or 8 45 at the latest so this day i did end up taking this walk for about 30 minutes the day was so beautiful and i walked up this hill right here it was so much fun loved it it kind of ate into my day though and so i ended up sitting at my desk around uh, 9 30 instead of 8 45 like i planned so once i took a shower um and dressed up i came into my home office area set, started setting up my computer and then one of the things i love to do after i set up my computer is write down the top three things i want to achieve in that day this particular day i was working on the tail end of a 24 page document that i've been writing um, in my science writing job and so i really needed to finish that and then i wanted to film this vlog as well so that was the main thing on my agenda i also love my love to make sure that i get some water in so i have some vitamin c here um, in the water and i and i got that done and then after that i got started with work around 9 27 a.m turning off the phone so i don't get distracted as well I like to focus in bursts and so um, I'll work for like 60 to 90 minutes at a stretch and then I'll take a break and then I'll do another 60 to 90 minutes. That always ends up being super productive for me. So it is now 11.19 a.m. Been working pretty consistently since 9.30ish and I'm taking a break been focused for about 90 minutes <laughs> so I'm taking a little bit of a break and right now I'm watching this video about Mars um, and let me bring it closer yeah so this video here on Mars and it just looks like one huge mountainous desert which is really interesting and yeah it's really interesting <laughs> right so right now it's like 12 52 p.m. and yeah I'm done with that document that I started around um, 9 30 this morning so very very excited I'm going to take some time to have some lunch I, I'm teaching my class today at 3 p.m. so there's not much I have to prep for that but I do need to check a few emails um, both from um, my writing um, job as well as the teaching one I need to check emails respond to emails um, and do certain really small tasks I always find it's like those five minute tasks that take up so much of your time the things that look so like oh this is a quick thing takes so much of, of your time so I like to stratify my day so that the most important thing i do first if i try to do those little other projects first it's always a mess it messes with my mind so i always like to 
do the major thing first which i've knocked the major thing off my list and i'm super excited so i'm gonna get some lunch and we'll continue with our day so at this point in my day um it's about 6 38 p.m and um was working all day uh, and I'm finally leaving this office area, which is half of a bedroom. Um, <laughs> I was watching some YouTube videos just to kind of wind down. I, you know, still have to work on um, my own business. So apart from the fact that I'm a science writer and professor, <clears throat> I do, and let me set this somewhere apart from the fact that i um write and teach i also run this youtube channel i run a youtube channel with my husband simple african meals where we share recipes um we try to do that <laughs> we try to do it weekly but it's not as consistent but we love the channel we have about 200 subscribers on there which we're really grateful for and then i have a blog that i'm starting for this channel the bold biomed um, called theboldbiomed.com. It's coming soon. Um, and so I'm constantly busy, but right now I'm just taking a break, just like winding down my day, doing something relaxing. So I was watching some YouTube videos. Forgive that mess over there. That's my son's school stuff. Um, <laughs> when you have a kid, your house, like, I feel like you shouldn't apologize for your house anymore. Um, but yeah, so this is what's going on. And it's been a long day so typically this is how my day will go it's fairly standard for me to wake up maybe get some exercise um, you know get to work and so on and so forth and then by the time I realize it's really the end of the day the day goes by so quickly um, so right now uh, my husband and my son stepped out and they're gonna come home I'm pretty sure they'll come soon but whilst they're gone I want to um, fold some laundry that I did a few days ago and put them away then once I put those away I feel like I'll feel better about the room where I've scattered all this laundry <laughs> uh, let me know let me know in the comments below if you uh, some people tell me they don't even fold their laundry because it's just too much work. Let me know if you're in that camp. <laughs> At this point in my day, I was beginning to wind down the day. Um, I got a message from my video editor who helps me with some of my videos um, that he had uploaded a video and so I was uh, reviewing those videos and messaging him back. Um, so I was doing a little bit of project management here. And then one of the things that my family and I love to do at the end of the day is just to take a ride out in town because of COVID-19. We stay home a lot. And so this ride is like our family time, our outside time. And it's always so relaxing just before we go to bed. Thanks for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe.